Let's see those 2D portraits. So it begins. This looks good so far. Oh, this is my jam! Actually, the portraits are of higher quality than I expected. I think it's a good change. Shall flee my yeah, I feel like it's a good change. Looks way better. I didn't expect that. I thought it was going to be bad. The portraits look really high quality, in my opinion. This is way better than what it was. God, I, myself and you guys, we were scared, right? We were holding each other's hands, weren't we? No, these are not the old portraits. There's better shading. Mm. Yeah, there's better shading and it feels comic book like. Nah. Yeah, you can't see the skin, but I think that's a good thing because so many times we got confused about who's who and what's what. They also zoomed it in more. This is the essentially the grub W of their portraits. Hey, I like the 3D as well. I liked the 3D as well. It's just, uh, this is more clear. And for me, clarity... Excuse me. Oh, yeah. Clarity over... Uh, over... Yeah, this. Anyway, we've got, like, uh, at least one known good player on both sides. Actually, I think there's two known good players on both sides right now. So this is going to be a little bit higher level. Greetings, um, friend. Well, can I count myself as one? I'm... I'm, I'm no king or GM. Actually, I, I think I might still be GM. Anyway, Master. And I know God of the West is very good. And I know Ardenia is pretty good on that team. And so is Tanke, obviously. Tanke, Gods are GM level. So, should be a pretty decent game. We shall see. Uh, the drafts are obviously fairly uh, balanced. We have Blaze as a solo laner. And we have Malthio as their solo laner. Nazebo is their late game power spike. And Nazebo Maev will be their, possibly okay. their uh, four man rotation. Lucio is their support, and I'm the support for this team. This is the third game of Deckard Kane that I'm playing today. And I've given a lot of instruction in my last two videos, as well as the try mode overview. So I'm going to delay instruction. And I'm going to refer you to all two YouTube videos, if that's what you uh, want to see. Go ahead and search through my channel. There were some yesterday and the day before, probably. And for you guys here on Twitch, you can rerun the VOD. I'm going to rerun it tonight, or you can rerun it yourself. Or it, whatever. Now I'm going to play my best. Or at least try. I'm going to go with Scroll of Identify. I've already settled on what I think is probably the best build. Got a four-man quest immediately to start things off with. I'm gonna try to uh, use my heals sparingly if I can avoid it. Got another two roots. Nice. Greetings, friend. Don't need to heal Phoenix yet. Anyway. See who needs heals. Keep in mind as a support, you can also check out their portrait on the top shelf. If anyone is low, even if it's your solo laner, check them out. Oh, rooted midair. So far, so good. Exactly. Um, this doesn't need to be picked up yet. Uh, he's wasting the heal a little bit like that. The range is really incredible. That was actually a root. Like, Nazebo instantly reacted. But the combo was easily done. You can always throw gems. I mean, throw potions on the gems.
At level 4, I'm going to take Ruby, which is a gem that empowers my Horadra cube. Keep in mind that, by the way, Deckard Kane is a lot more vulnerable when he's um, by himself, because he doesn't get the armor or the CDR. The heal range is pretty good. It's about blink heal, but you don't actually need to blink to them. I see Phoenix is dying. Unfortunate. Gonna get the Ruby now. It's almost never worth it. He knew he's gonna get a lot of heals. That's why he was able to do that. My journey continues. Now I'm running out of mana a little bit. That is an expensive combo if you miss it, especially E into W. I am surrounded Being a melee me. attacker, it's almost never worth it as uh, Kane, who lacks mobility, to uh, walk up and attack someone. I should be using my ruby more often. I am healed. Surrounded by fiends. It's amazing that Haraja Cube with Ruby actually becomes a heal as well. Which is like a non. Mm, oh. A non. Uh, heal. Activatable heal. Like you can do it with Ruby. I'm gonna get the Cube Mastery. When I hit heroes with Cube, I get more scroll ceiling, which is the roots and the damage. This is not Hero League, this is a 5v5 custom game. Foul oh, minions! Eighty-three damage I on it there. Amazing. <laughs> I've got 15 stacks. It's an 8 second reveal, by the way, my scroll ceiling from the level 1 talent. I can cast it again because uh, I got the CDR. Seems like really good healing. I'm gonna go for the fountain. We do miss out on a bit of experience because we haven't killed as many players, but uh, Genji Gods of the West did much to get us back in it. It's uh, dangerous. We uh, made our getaway, nice. Seems like uh, Kane and Genji work together like a horse and carriage. They go together like peas and carrots. Nice town portal. 
Stay a while and listen. What Stay a while and listen has a one second wind up. And sound barrier, I think is less than that. Or maybe it's one second as well. So if I, I have to preempt it if I want to interrupt the sound barrier. Now I can see it, it's also one second. Yeah, so I have to preempt it. I have 20k heal, a little bit less than Lucio, but that's how Lucio works generally. I think my bottom laners are in trouble. Okay, quest complete. And it's now a longer reveal and an armor debuff as well. I comboed my ult with uh, a scroll ceiling. Now I'm gonna get uh, ancient blessings then. Everyone has splash heal now. that are near me or what? Everyone is splashing and healing now. I just did a big ancient blessing. I would have to watch the VOD again to see exactly what happened there. But I think it was good. Yes, the E currently also debuffs towers, which seems a little bit too good. Considering in the past they removed exactly that functionality from Sylvana. Minus 15 armors and buildings. Time to debuff their buildings to make the web weavers more effective. Go, my The armor was diva. Armor diva and ancient blessings as well. Um, scroll stone curse. 
so crazy. Oh, 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 oh. No, no, no. So crazy right now. It's gonna do almost 900 damage. Yeah, I think staff stun is probably a bad idea. We are 12 gems away from paying. I'm gonna go turn in now. We should pay what we have for now. I think it's fine. Interrupted his ult. Lots of mini potions. So that's how you can interrupt sound barrier and it's it has such a big radius It's really such a hard counter to many many things uh, from Lucio and otherwise There is something disquieting here Splash damage and bonus damage You can just leave with right click. I'm going to stay back. Back. Fine work, it's not needed friend. to ult anymore when you come out of bunker because they changed the bunker that you can right click to leave it. At last. <laughs> stay a while and listen. Yes. What? Where are you going? Yes, if you go over five potions, the oldest one gets deleted the moment that you uh, pick up, that, that you throw a new one. So now I got reduction on the gem. Oh, he got rooted. Uh, the trait is activatable if you take the level 13 talent for it, yes. Alright, that was uh, Deckard Kane, the first time playing what I thought would be the most effective build, which is combining Scroll of Identify with the CDR for the E, so you get more armor debuffs, more reveals, more damage. Then for the team fight, you have Group Haradra Cube Heals, you have Shorter Haradra Cube Duration, Again, more group heals, because that's CD art as well, with the level 20. And then you've got the group 
ranged semi mush pit Greetings, and ancient friend. blessings which gives all of your allies basic attack damage and heals which is really insane so when you turn all those buttons on you get group potions they are asleep you're healing and splashing you're doing a lot of damage on big roots more often and you're debuffing their armor very strong so that uh, I feel like we just won the video game uh, that's probably one of the better builds I would say though I've been wrong before <laughs> but I think so uh, sapphire is also strong and so is emerald so the other gems may also be used but for now that was gonna be the last game of Kane that I played tonight and now I would still like to play a little bit of Hero League.